Hey guys, this is J19 brought to you with another video. In today's video, we're going to discuss the official story trailer, which I have reacted to that with the showcase, but I want to go in like details what I think is going to happen, um, theories and speculations and stuff like that. Um, I am looking forward to this game. I will be streaming it on my channel, so if you guys want to see that happen when it comes out, please uh, like, subscribe, hit the bell notifications to stay notified when I go live. And uh, with that said, let's uh, start breaking down this video. Uh, let's get going on it. Hey now, think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Okay, to me, I think this is where, this is where they're talking about the uh, the events of Resident Evil Seven. Um, I have not played it, but I know a little bit of it. And uh, sorry about that. And I know a little bit of it, and uh, <clears throat> I'm excited to see more, like how their relationship is in this game. Um, like you see in the story, like that's all we ever talk about now these days. Like talk about, oh, we need to move on from what happened, you know, in the past. And and she's like not really, she's not having it with Ethan right now. So that's what I'm thinking right now. Again, I think uh, when the bells is striking, that means like it must be like a an annual thing, or or uh, the the season is right, like the conditions are right for the for I think the vampires, la the ladies, and uh, the tall the tall woman that everybody's like craving about right now. Um, I think I think they're uh, they're holding a. Uh, Something special, something's gonna, something big is gonna happen, and the woman laughing there is like, they're they're gonna come after us again, ha ha ha, you know, she's laughing, and uh, because the bells are ringing, that means it's, it's that time again, so that's what she's doing, she's warning us that they're gonna come, they're gonna come for people, they're coming for the people because of what they are, so let's continue. <laughs> Mother Miranda. I regret to inform you that Ethan Winters has escaped that fool Heisenberg. Uh, again, um, she's uh, talking to Mother Miranda. She's got to be, Mother Miranda's got to be the head honcho. Um, I'm not sure who she is. You know, she's still a mystery at this point. But apparently the tall lady is not the head honcho. She takes orders from Mother Miranda, who is instructing her and her sis and her daughters that hey you now look i'm in control here and apparently she's warning miranda 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 that her brother idiot brother heisenberg is has let like lost sight of ethan like ethan has escaped his grasp because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle when i find him no, Mother Miranda. Yes, of course, I understand the importance of the ceremony. I won't let you down. All right, lights. She's telling Mar Mother Miranda, yes, I understand the ceremony that we got to perform will go on. Yes, we will get it done. But right now, like, I got I to get Ethan. I got to get this under control. So even my daughters, my daughters are having issues with Getting, getting control of Ethan. So she's going to take matters in her own hands and tell her daughter this is how we're going to run things. That's one thing that's going to happen. And uh, I'm really interested to see who Mother Miranda is and I wonder if we'll get to see her in this game. And wonder if she's going to be like the like a boss of some sort. That would be kind of interesting. Someone, please tell me what the hell is going on here. No, the place is full of nothing but blood and death.
this is this place is nothing but blood and death. Like they must be talking the whole like the castle and stuff. It's like no, no, this is nothing. Uh, castles and death. And if you look back, if we look back at the the place is full of nothing but blood and death. Oh, I keep missing that. Dang it! Right there. If you guys look at that, I know it's kind of hard to see on my end because of the brightness and stuff, but uh. That that is part of the demo, but he doesn't have the other two like uh um those two things that they light up. Um that's that's part of the demo and the door is hidden in this in this trailer, but in the demo it's open up in the cellar, so the dungeon. So I wonder if we gotta light those up. As I heard somebody in the other video, uh they said that if you light those two up, maybe that doorway comes open. The another like short little puzzle. So I'll keep that in mind. Of nothing but blood and death. Scarecrow. So you know he's going down in a dungeon. Yeah, that's the dungeon part. And those hooded zombies, hooded and uh, undead looking things. Uh, it sounds pretty familiar in the uh, Maiden's demo. Uh, kind of like it's more a little bit different. I wonder if that's if one of those it might be something totally different, but I'm kind of curious. I'm I'm glad to see zombies are back. Well, in this you know, the continuation of Eastern story, seeing that zombies are back, the undead creatures, um, with the hoods, and uh, they are wielding weapons, so it's gonna be kind of interesting to see how that's gonna work out. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to see. And uh, they'll say you got different enemy varieties, all the trailers we've seen so far. So I'm looking forward to that. There she is. If we go back to. Table, okay. Okay, right there, that's, uh, oh, there we go. Sorry about that, guys. I got to tap it twice. Um, so, my apologies. I need to do a little bit better job of that. But, yeah, this is where they're looking up, I think, at Ethan. So, I don't know if they got him, like, strung up on something or they got him, like, I don't know. Like, I don't know what's going on there. But they're looking at them like, hey, we finally caught you after all the trouble you've done. So, if we go back to that statue... Oh, wait a minute. Where's that statue at? All right, right there. That statue. That statue is actually in the demo. It's locked behind a door. You can only see like a little tiny glimpse of that. So it looks kind of creepy. Like they got one that's like they, they're stabbing that person below them. And it uh, looks like the bigger, taller figure. It's like holding on to one of the daughters or something. So that might be the tall lady representation um we're not quite sure yet but it might be a puzzle of some sort we gotta do and of course that was the ladies um they can teleport with their you know they turn into bugs and all that which is kind of creepy with that statue, now that's interesting chris is taking the baby and he's looking at looking at probably at ethan and like smiling I don't know what's going on there. I don't know what Chris's uh, story is, uh, what his involvement in the Resident Evil 8 villain, but I'm kind of interested to see. No, I'm not kind of. I am interested to see how his role plays out in this because it looks like he's pretty evil. He's like, he's taken, you know, their daughter and uh, he's killed. I think he's, I think he killed Mia in one of the other trailers. It's like, wow. It's like, what the heck's going on here? So, yeah, it makes me worry. I wonder. Tall. Wow, wow, Ethan Winters. That coffee. There you are. Um, that's the first time she sees him. <laughs> yeah. Of course, that's the daughter. That's one from the demo. And we got just a little bit left, guys. Who the fuck are you? Let's see what you're really made of. Ethan, Ethan Winters. Winters. 
Now there, he's got some kind of like telekinesis powers where he's lifting up. It looks like uh, like metal, like cogs and uh, wheels and stuff like that. That's going to be kind of interesting. Um, my theory on that, and one of the uh, gameplay videos I showed, uh, the review of the gameplay first, you know, first look. Um, it shows like a uh, giant looking like mountain man looking thing with a hammer, just like that. So I think that you get to fight him in human form, but then like later on he progresses into that form. Well, he might just transfer him automatically, but I guess that might be Heisenberg, possibly. It might be uh, the tall woman's uh, brother. Um, that oh uh, he like escapes Ethan. Uh, Ethan escapes him. And then maybe we gotta end up fighting him. He's like, we'll, Ethan, we'll see what you're made of. And then the gameplay footage shows a giant uh, mountain man looking creature with a hammer and it looks similar to that. I wonder if it's gonna be him. He looks cool. May 7th. Alright, guys, that's, uh, that's it for that video. Uh, I wanna thank you guys for stopping by. Uh, I apologize for. Uh, the notifications on my phone uh, since I do a screen record. I hope you guys, uh, hope you guys are just, you know, just uh, hope you guys uh, understand that. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, let me know in the comments below what you guys think of my theories and uh, about what the trailer and all that. And and uh, I think I'm interested. It's gonna be it's gonna be a scary game. Like the uh, the demo really did scare me a little bit. So, anyways, you guys uh, let me know in the comments below. I, again, if you guys are new to the channel, please like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, and stay notified when I go live or upload my next video. And uh, I hope you guys have a wonderful day, wonderful night. Keep on keeping on. I'll catch you all in the next one. Please take it easy out there, guys. Be safe. Be nice to each other. I'll catch you all on the next one.